Hi, my name is Hania Jodat. I'm here with Progressive Hub interviewing the one and only Jay Ponte, who has just authored the book called Be the Revolution. So he's going to talk a little bit about the book, Progressive Central 2024, and what brings him here. Hi, Jay. Good to be here with you. Uh, good to see you as always. Uh, yeah, it's called Be the Revolution, How Occupy Wall Street and the Bernie Sanders Movement Reshaped American Politics. And it is a first-person journey from Occupy uh, through two Bernie campaigns, Standing Rock, um, and then right up through the rebirth of American labor. But it shows how um, you know most people think that Occupy failed and that Bernie sort of came out of the free market because he appealed to unrealistic millennials. And it's actually both are patently untrue. And in fact, it was uh, PDA and Occupy activists that pushed Bernie to run. And this is really hugely important because most people think that Bernie just kind of came out of the free market. Thank you so much. And PDA is Progressive Democrats of America, obviously, who is now sponsoring this wonderful event where there's going to be a lot of progressive speaking, a lot of Congress members who align with us ideologically. Jay, what inspired you to be here today? And tell me a little bit about what inspired you to write this book. Well, for me, the the um, it is really critical that the younger generations coming up right now have institutional memory. And we learned a lot from 2000. Actually, the book goes back to 2004, to the, the birth of the progressive movement with the Dennis Kucinich campaign. But it's really important for young people organizing or anyone uh, who wants to go in and take on what I call the corporate state uh, to understand the tactics that have worked, what hasn't worked, and then to show... Um, you know, to, to connect with the power of this grassroots organizing. And it's a modern theory of change because most of the, a lot of the organizing tactics that we still operate out of are outdated, whereas the, the fascist right is innovating wildly, as we saw um, with Steve Bannon in, in 2016. Thank you so much. And obviously you're going to be speaking on a panel today. So tell us a little bit about that, what that's about, and what are you hoping to accomplish here today? So I'll just be speaking on my own. Um, I'll be getting up to address the crowd, but I'll be talking about a, a national get out the vote tour uh, and activist training. We're going to be going around the country uh, and we'd love anyone to participate. We'll be partnering with, Unco with uh, Generation Common Good and bringing activist trainings to young people at colleges and fighting for health justice, climate justice, racial justice, economic justice. And we hope people to join us. Uh, and definitely get the book because it's a wild journey. It's also the only book to ever have 85 QR codes, which give you videos to all the things. So it's, but it, but if you were there in 2016 or 2020, if you were at Standing Rock, if you're, it, you know, this is really our story from the grassroots. It's not a top down, uh, journalist, you know, who wasn't there and writing academically. This is, this is really what our experience and you were there too. Um, and it chronicles our fight and all of our, you're going to recognize all of the people there, but, um, you know, it's, uh, it's really a, an honor to, to share this with you. And where can people find the book? Uh, go to be the revolution us. And if you go to be the revolution us slash home, there's a free bonus chapter on, uh, why Trump won. So it's an autopsy of the 2016 election, uh, which didn't make the book, but, uh, you can download that as a free, as a free chapter. Thank you, Jay Ponte, everyone. Hania Jodat coming to you from Progressive Live. We're in Chicago. Stay tuned for more interviews.